Hi everyone, it's Andrea and welcome back to the channel. So it's time for that time it is that time of the month where we look at all the pages we coloured in the month. And I have coloured 24 pictures this month, which is pretty good going. I mean sometimes I do more, sometimes I do less, it depends. I'm pleased. There most there's a lot of patterns, but there are some good pictures as well. So I know a lot of you show you completed pe the pens that you've used in the month. Well, all I've used is, I mean, I've only used glitter pens, but the only ones that have run out this month are glitter pens. So as you can see, we've got a couple of link shines in there. There's a few a and Art, there's an Arteza there, and an unbranded one there. So it's all been, all the glitters have been running out on me this month. I've just got to find somewhere to put them there while I do the rest of the haul, uh, the video. Okay, so 24 colours. Uh, colour pictures this month. Let's get into it. So the first one I did was, well it's not the first one, but the first one I'm going to show you because they're not in any order, it's chocolate on it. It's in Zen, Zen Colouring Springtime Designs and you'll see why I used up so much glitter this month because obviously I did this one. Now I know that the green changes colour halfway down it's because the pen ran out. <laughs> and this one took quite a while as you can see but do you know what I really enjoyed doing it. It was just really relaxing just doing it. It was a mixture of um, Arteza, a and uh, link shine and anything else I could get my hands on. <laughs> um, but yeah, so that was just all gel pen, but I enjoyed that one. I've got nowhere to put these books, so I'm going to have to go on the floor. Um, Easy Colouring Book by Jade Summer. Now, I did one in here because it's quite a pretty book. And I did the flowers, and again, all glitter. Probably all link shine on this one, looking at it. Um, but yeah, it was just uh, apart from the stems, I think they were a mixture of pens. But yeah, it was really nice. It was just a really fun colour to do. Very easy. I didn't do a black. I was thinking of doing a black background, but I thought, no, I can't be doing that. I'll just leave it on the white. It looks really nice. Um, I did one in Fiercely Gorgeous Grey Scale by Evelyn Liza. This was a buddy colour with Chelsea J. Murray colouring. Um, I'm sure she'll be showing hers as well shortly. And we did this book, this picture in the book. I did um do the blacked background i might start doing some different kind of backgrounds like some acrylic paint ones as well i just don't like these busy flowers and um, there is some glitter on there some link shine glitter on her top and her earrings but it was done with the ohuhu markers and i think i did her makeup with i want to say prisma color because i've been using them a bit this month i've fallen in love with my prisma colors again i haven't used them for ages and this month i've been using them and i'm falling in love with them again so i'm going to use them a lot <laughs> it's because i've been getting to grips with polychromos properly and i really love those as well now so but yeah so there's that one i love her eyeshadow <laughs> so that was done with chelsea j marie coloring it's also on both of our instagrams now i think my instagram uh, let me just tap I will put it underneath if I remember, but I'm terrible at remembering my Instagram. I'll get to it first because, of course, I've not got that anywhere. It is the battery's running out on my phone? Andy P1974. So A N D I P for Papa. 1974 and if you go on there you can see all my photos it's all everything it's photographs of me jennifer but there's also all my uh, coloring pages well not all of them but a lot of my coloring pages go on there another pattern jade summer 100 swirls i haven't done one in here for ages which is why i pulled it out it's got to get to it whoops i do these in order generally i like that one and this was done with a mixture of scribblicious and the ones from Lidl's, but I can't remember what their names, but that's what that was, a mixture of those. That was a nice one to do, it's very enjoyable. I did one in Live Your Dreams, and I thought these aren't my favourites, the ones with the words in, but uh, for Pride Month, I did Life is Better with You. I'm just got a little rainbow at the top, so, so I did that one, it's my Pride one. I don't think I've posted it anywhere. I was going to, and I've sort of kind of run out of time. But I really enjoyed that. And again, that was done with uh, Scriblicious and the ones from Lidl's. I do use them a lot. I try and use everything. It's just sometimes you tend to pick up on one more than anything else. I picked 
picked up my Easy Mandala colouring book, Easy Flower Mandala, I haven't done one in here for a while, by Stefan Miro, Stefania Miro, um, black background ones, and I did this one, and this was done with some kind of markers, but I don't know which ones. I'm looking at the colours. This, I think, was done with the Cray Box ones, Cray Box ones, which were um, the ones I normally use in the next book, the Rose Window book, but they were the ones, uh, the, 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 again, they came alcohol markers from Liddles. And I like that. It's really bright. I did two in Rose Windows. I did one with the Cray Box, Cray Box ones and one with the Oh Hoo Hoo's. So the first one I did, which was with Cray Box, or Cray Box, however it's pronounced, is this one. And um, I just love those. They're really quick to do. It's not going to take me long to finish this book, I don't think, because I love colouring it as well. And that one was done with the Oh Hoo Hoo's, and that's really nice as well. There's that one. I love that book. Uh, one of the Ava Brown uh, freebies PDFs I got from Tattoos, I did the crown and the flowers um, and I used all glitter pens on this um, mostly um, Link Shine but there was another one that the purple one was a different brand and I just to make it if you look it's I haven't done the white bit behind it's just the normal paper but all I did was put the ink on and just smear it like I do the, the fairy wings before so that's that one. I'm going to actually just uh, pop that down. And then I did one in Jade Summers Anime. It's taken me ages to do this one. I love the work. It's just taken me ages to do it. I actually did this cover picture. Uh, if I can find it. And that was done using the Oh Hoo Hoo Barkers, which I love. And I, I did actually, when I got into it, I really quite enjoyed it. So... So, you know, you pick up something you want to do and then you don't really want to do it again and you move on to something else. But So, again, a lot of markers this month. There are, is some pencil stuff coming up. Not a huge amount, but there is some. Yeah, there's this one. Put books everywhere. This happens every month. Another one of the free Ava Brown PDFs I got for being in the club, the launch team. This is from Cosplay Cats. It's the Ice Skater. I got a photograph of this and put it up on my Insta and on the Ava Brown colouring group. So this was done with Oh Hoo Hoo markers and as you can see I've missed a bit there so I'll have to go and find that green. Um, that's a little bit, it could be sunlight anyway. And I've put some glitter on her dress, not a lot, just a little bit of uh, dots of link shine and some on her skates as well. But I like that because I love ice skating so I'll put that to one side and I'll try and find that uh, funny green. Just so it's finished when I post it properly, but it is finished as far as I'm concerned. Kawaii Grayscale by Ava Brown, we did this in colour and chat, didn't we? Remember? And like I said, these aren't in any order, they just ended up in this part. And this was The Little Mermaid. I think she's so adorable. Hoo Hoo Markers and Link Shine Glitter Pens. Back to Jade Summer. This is uh, 50 easy patterns. I love these pattern books. And I did this one. This is the one I had to buy the Rain Arts second set of gel pens from. I ran out of pink and I ran out of green and I ran out of yellow. So, yeah, as you can see, I do love these and I just wanted to do something bright and cheerful and it's e sparkly. I can't actually see any sparkle at the moment. In fact, it's not sparkly. Yeah, it is sparkly. And I just it was nice to do. Started in the middle and worked my way around. I finally finished my whips in, and I say whips because there's two, in World uh, Words of Wonder by Johanna Basford. Yay! So I've actually done two in this book. I did the title page and this was done with Black Widows just a mixture of all the black widows and some glitter gel pen on the title and the heart and that's just a mixture of various pens I enjoyed that one uh, but Jennifer wanted to pick colours so I did this one at the house in the balloons and Jennifer picked the colours now normally she just picked blue all the time but so I'd steer it towards a pick I think she pick a blue okay I'll do something do that bit blue um, pick a different colour 
what do you like on this one? Actually, the orange. Which way should we put that orange? Oh, on the sky. So that's why we've got an orange sky, we've got blue stars, and we've got multicolored clouds. And it's just like, like really fantastical or different. So, and again, that was done with the Black Widows and Prisma colours, actually. Some of it was done with Prisma colours, and I really like the way the Prismas go down on this paper better than the Black Widows, to be honest. So, I'll be using the Prismas in here. I need to buy another set of them. Some of them are getting really small. Colour by number patterns. I forgot I had this one because there's two pattern books. There's beautiful patterns and just patterns. So I did this one. Again, this was done with the Oh Hoo Hoo's. I seem to be using these in this book, these books mostly. And I do enjoy the colour by numbers. Let's take that piece of paper out now because we don't need it in there anymore. Oops, it doesn't want to come out. Oh, I do apologise. I'm being a bit ditzy today. There. So yeah, so there's that one. Like I said, lots of patterns, lots of jade summer patterns. Then I've got the colour by number flowers by Jade Summer because I got all of these. As you know, I collect these books, and I did this one again with the Oh Hoo Hoo markers, and I'm really liking the, these purples. They're really nice colours. I try and do one of these, at least one of these a month, so that I've got. You know, so I'm working through the book because next year I might put this on my books to complete because I might try and do that challenge next year if they still do it. I'm going to do 10 books to complete in 2022 and I'm pretty sure some of these Jane Summer patterns will be on it. One that I don't think will be on it is the Sally Berry 300 Mandala book, although I have done another one in here this month, only one this month. And I did this one with gel pens, a bit of gel pens. A mixture of different brands, no particular one. So, I'm, again, I work my way through the book in order, but just simply because that's how I like to do the patterns. You know, if I don't like one, I will skip it and go back to it. Usually, it's ones that have got animals in it. I'm not keen on them. Oh, we're near the end now. Uh, we only got a few more today, but there's that one. I love this book. It's just so chunky, but it's so. So good. Uh, Fantasy by Ava Brown. Remember we did this one on camera and we did this uh, the cover page. I really love this picture. I'm really pleased with the way it turned out. I think this is my favourite of the month and this is where I used um, some gel pen. Not a lot but just a little bit and I'm going to try doing that a bit more. Yeah, that's why I bought them. So there's that one and again oh hoo hoo markers been using them a lot the anime one was oh hoo hoo and um Evan blend actually uh, 50 easy mandalas by jade summer because i just jade summer mad another glitter one link shine red gold and green it's my karma chameleon one like it i don't always do it sometimes i use markers i did that gray one last month remember so. but again these are simple to do i like to try and do one a month just to Get the book going and there's 50 of those so possible for next month next year who knows again mandalas for beginners <laughs> so many jade summer so many patterns who knows what's going to happen next month. that's the last one i did that way um, oh gosh there's lots oh, let's get past it here we are and again glitter can you tell i'm trying to use up some of the empty glitters the ones that are nearly empty because um, I think one of the colours does change somewhere. The green changes, so you've got that green and it goes to that green because <laughs> the green ran out. But there, that's that one. I, that's various glitter gel pens. I don't think there was Link Shine at all in there. No, no Link Shine. That was just completely Aeon, Rayon, whatever you want to call them, um, Arteza, and whatever other brands they were, the unbranded ones. Another one I've done in Colour in Heaven Gothic Alchemy. I love this book, it's just terrifying. But I just went in with a couple of markers, if I can find the page. Oh, they're so nice. And oh, that's, I love that one. That's what I did with it. Let me find it. Oh, uh, oh me. come on, where is it? Got a tag in it, haven't I? And I just did the, the skull and the rose. It's hard to see it actually that it is a skull down there. You can see it? Yeah, you can actually. It's very dark red. Probably went too dark with the red to use the lighter one, but I still like it. And it's just, it's another picture down. It's called Stigmata Rose. I really like this book and I want to do some more in it. I want to do some more pencils in it. I'll try the prismas in it and see how they go. That's that one. 
last two are jade summer color by numbers we've got color by number mandalas which is here again this is oh hoo hoo Go. that actually looks really nice on camera I'm looking at it up from above on the, the screen and it looks amazing I love it and the last one is in beautiful patterns so I, I, again I just try and do one of these every month I love them and it was this one I love this one it feel, I like the fact that it practically fills the whole page apart from the little border and I'm really enjoying this book. I think it's fantastic. Can't wait to do another one in it. So these ones I'll probably keep an eye out to do straight away. So those are all the pictures I have coloured in in the month of June. <laughs> I'm just going to pop them together like that. I hope you've enjoyed this video and um, let me know what you like which one's your favorite one uh, down in the uh, comments below and i will see you in the next video bye everybody